welcome back guys so today we are going to discuss a very important topic and that is basically the so today we are going to discuss what we are going to discuss NAND and NOR equivalent of the fundamental digital logic gates or digital logic circuits so why is it important to represent them with these NAND and NOR gates this is because the uh, availability of NAND and NOR gate as a natural gates okay so therefore most of the gates either it is NOR gate AND gate or OR gate or most of them are basically made of the NAND and NOR gate and that is the easily availability easy availability of the NAND and NOR gates okay so first of all what we are going to do we are going to discuss the NAND gate okay and we have to see that how different gates can be made up of this NAND gate okay so the first gate here let me see that if I have a NAND gate so NAND gate is basically represented by the symbol which is here and we are going to discuss a NAND gate which has two inputs okay so if we have two input NAND gate and at the input we apply A such that the two inputs are shorted together so at the output of it what I will get I will get A complement and that is basically the equivalent of a gate which is called the inverter or NOT gate to which we apply A the input and the output we get the inverting output okay so this is what this is the NOT gate which is made of this so let me write the name of it so this is the NOT gate which is made of what this NAND gate okay similarly if we have a NAND gate okay let me write it if we have a NAND gate and if I apply two inputs to it what I will get out of it I will get a b whole complement okay so if the same output is applied to another gate which is another NAND gate okay so if the two input NAND gates we short it down and to it we apply it what I will get at the output of it I will get here a b okay which is word which we can very easily see that this is a simplified version of a gate which is called the AND gate okay so at the input of it I have applied a b and at the output of it what I have got I have got a b okay so we can very easily see here that two of the most fundamental gates one is the let me uh, underline them so the first of them is the NOT gate second is the AND gate we can very easily uh, make them by using the NAND gates okay similarly if I have let me use it here and if I have two AND gates okay this is a first AND gate this is a second NAND gate okay so if I have two NAND gates and to them I have applied what to this gate I have applied A and while to this I have applied B and the out at the output of them what I will get here I will get A complement while here I have got this B complement and these are again applied to another NAND gate and if this is connected here okay and at the output of it what I will get at the output of it I will get A complement dot B complement and whole complement okay so what is this this is basically the expression here and if I want to simplify it let me simplify it by using this blue color so according to the de Morgan's law I know that A complement dot B complement whole complement is equal to what that is equal to the A complement complement plus B complement complement what is this this is because this sign has been changed while the complement has been issued to both of the terms here so what I will get here complement and complement will cancel each other we can see that this will cancel each other 
while here this symbol has been changed to this so at the output of it what i will get i will get here a plus b so therefore i can write here that this is equal to the a plus b which is what which i can very easily see that the functionality of the or gate to which two inputs a and b are applied and the output of it i have got this a plus b and this is the functionality of the or gate okay so what if i want to make it an or gate what i can do here i can very easily connect here the inverter or not gate and this inverter is here this one this one is the inverter and i can use it here and to that i will get what i will get here then this gate okay and that would be the nor gate to which the two inputs are applied and at the output of it what i will get i will get a plus b whole complement okay so these are all the gates okay this is the gate number 1 2 and 3 so these are the fundamental gates which are made up of this nand gate okay so this is a one of the very important lecture in which we have seen that how different gates can be made up of this nand gate okay in the next lecture we will talk about the gates which can be made of this nor gate so stay tuned and i will see you in the next lecture with the next topic okay see you soon